Coach Your Brain, day 18. Today I would like to talk about intuition. Where is intuition in the brain? What is intuition? And how can we tap into our intuition? This week I had an insight of intuition and as you all know I was swinging through the trees quite happily the other day uh, testing my amygdala and taking my amygdala for a spin. Now the day after I was suffering. I had really really terrible back lower back pain and obviously it was from the activity and maybe I had just uh, pulled the muscles there maybe I was using muscles that I don't normally use obviously I don't normally swing through the trees and go along zip lines and I tried through that first day afterwards to get through the day uh, uh, deal with the pain it was a lot of pain I tried to stretch do some exercise and kind of got through the day but really really struggling and being very careful the day after I was still in a lot of pain so again I tried to deal with it I went to the chemist I got some uh, painkillers which I never normally take by the way so really indicates that I was in a lot of pain and I even went to my paddleboard and I did a little bit of paddleboard, but when I came off and I sat in the car, something was telling me, you need to go and see a physiotherapist. I've no idea what that little voice was, but there was a little voice in my gut, which was kicking in saying, you need a physiotherapist now this minute. So I listened to my little voice and I instantly called uh, a center for physiotherapy and asked for an appointment urgently and they got me an appointment. The physio, when she literally got hold of me, she said, thank God you've come because you were in danger of absolutely seizing up. Your lower back is so inflamed that there was a danger that you were going to block. It's a couple of days later now after that and I really am a lot better. I'm uh, uh, nearly pain free, I'm walking around, I'm doing my exercise, I went to paddle yesterday and I would say I'm back to normal. And I'm looking back thinking, wow, where did that little voice come from? The interesting thing is that in 2017, there was a research paper on the science of intuition. And actually, they talk about the fact that the US military uh, have been investigating a lot about intuition because they want to further develop the sixth sense of soldiers. Now, apparently, our intuition in the brain is the entire right side of the brain. That's where the intuition operates, plus the hippocampus and through our gut. Now, we know that the vagus nerve is the great connector of all of the major organs with the brain. So it seems that we have this connector, the entire right side, the hippocampus and the gut, which are that little voice from beyond, which we can call our intuition. And apparently, ladies, women have a thicker corpus callosum, and this is the part of the brain connecting the two hemispheres. So it seems that ladies' intuition, women's intuition, is in fact stronger than men. So we could actually say that women's brains are superpowers. That's what they say in this article that I'm reading. 
that women's brains are superpowers that can actually optimize rapid, intuitive decision making. Thank you.